guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome back to your favorite girl on the internet. That's me, by the way. If you are new here, my name is Jasmine Rosette and today's video is going to be a grocery haul of everything that I got at Trader Joe's. But before we get into the haul, I would ask that you would give this video a thumbs up if you like any part of this video, subscribe so you can keep up to date with me and all things that I am doing, and comment down below, say hi, I say hi back. And without any further ado, let's get into this grocery haul, girl. That wasn't a good tongue pop, but it is what it is. <laughs> Anyways, I thought I would do a grocery haul today, mainly also to show off like my new hairstyle. I'm still, you know, with the gray braids like always, but I just went with the front part um, having cornrows and then everything in the back is just like singles. So it's out of my face. <laughs> But yeah, I also have a cut on my forehead, so I have like Neosporin on there, and I just brush my eyebrows with some castor oil, because I really want the front part of my eyebrows here to grow, because like, this one looks full. This one is not, which makes this one my not-so-good eyebrow. And I would like them to be as equals, you know, I want them to be equals. I want them to be sisters, not twins, but you know, it'd be nice to like not have to fudge it up every time I try to fill in the front part of my brow so that is that but anyways I'm gonna show you guys everything that I got today at Trader Joe's I'm currently sipping on a matcha latte that I got from a coffee shop mm. it is a matcha latte with oat milk and I had a macro bar today it is currently Sunday I woke up so so incredibly late like really really late <laughs> I woke up at 11 o'clock this morning my grandma called me and it woke me up like I did wake up when my alarm went off at 7 30 and I was like oh I'll just get like a few more minutes of sleep several hours later like literally I woke up at 11 o'clock so I guess I really needed that sleep but as you can tell I'm fully energized prepped and primed and ready to go and yeah it's a beautiful like summer day it's been hot the past few days maybe that's the reason why I also slept in because it's been hot and I get really sleepy when I'm hot but yeah oh I'm gonna shout out a few brands real quick so I think I mentioned this before but I am trying to be like more ethical and sustainable with my shopping there's this brand called Pine and Smith I've modeled for them in the past on Instagram. They make these beautiful like linen dresses. And yeah, Joanna is the founder. I've been modeling for her for several years. Obviously the past couple years have not been modeling. Also the photographer who was in charge of like the shoots like moved overseas and stuff like that. So I'm not modeling anymore. But yeah, I she's an ethical and sustainable brand, woman owned and has always like supported me and so I will make sure to link her stuff down below so you guys can check out her stuff her dresses also have pockets like that's a plus I wear these dresses a lot when I'm going on errands and stuff like that they're just really comfortable they're great summer dresses you can also layer them and all that stuff she also has different styles she has shirts as well and um, dungarees too and then another brand is Cotopaxi. I have been wanting to get a fanny pack for the longest time. I've had a fanny pack in the past, but I wasn't fully in love with it. And I also really want like a designer fanny pack. But that's that's a that's a topic for another day. But I really like Cotopaxis because they have multiple colors, and you can also like create your own color online. But you could also like choose pre-made colors so they had a store at cherry creek mall here in the greater denver area and so i went i had no idea they had a, a mall like a storefront i just thought they were only online so when i saw it because i was trying to get some sneakers and i didn't find what i was looking for and i had passed by put a paxi and i was just like no better time than the present you know so i got this one and it's like colorful on the inside as well but they're an ethical and sustainable brand they support artisans and stuff like that so they have really really good 
initiatives behind this brand. So these are two brands that I think you guys should totally check out, Cotopaxi and Pine and Smith. Check those out if you are interested. I will leave links to all of these brands down below so you can check out ethical and sustainable brands if you are interested. And now we shall get into this grocery haul because, you know, that's what we're here for. <laughs> also, I'm going to share how much I spent. I don't know if that'll be helpful for you guys or not, but I'll share that. I spent about $70, uh, maybe just under a little $70 getting all of this stuff. So I will show you guys that now. First things first, I've had two macro bars, the smooth sanctuary kind. I had one this morning and I'll have one later this week because I woke up really late this morning. This was part of my breakfast along with my matcha latte, as you guys saw. I got myself some chicken, some salmon. I have been really loving this spicy lentil wrap. You can have it hot or you can have it cold. It comes with a spicy peanut sauce. I really, really enjoy this. It is very, very good and yeah, that's a little bit of the nutritional facts there for you so you can see, but it tastes really good and I like it. And it's like, you know, vegan. <laughs> like it literally says it there. It's a nice vegan like meal. And I like to have these when I'm in a rush or, you know, don't really want to pay a lot of money for like a lunch or something like that. I will grab one of these. Usually every time I go to Trader Joe's, at least the past couple months, I've been doing that. So getting the protein out the way with the chicken and the salmon. I have wild arugula or rocket, depending on where you're from. But I got some of this along with some kale. So I can have some salads. I also have some lemon here because I've been having lemon water every single day. And then also with my salmon, I have been putting lemon on there as well because I like my salmon very citrusy and this is just perfect for that and it tastes really good. I, <laughs> I'm getting tired of having oatmeal every day so I got eggs, bacon, and avocado so that I can start having avocado on toast again. And I got two sets of the ginger shot and the turmeric shot because I like to have these every week. It, it makes me feel good about myself. <laughs> and my favorite chips, plantain chips. I didn't buy as much, but I just got two packs because I thought, I thought that was fine. And I have some Watermelon Wonder from GTS. Their kombucha, because I really like their flavor. I also got some green juice as well and my fave i got the health aid pink lady kombucha there's also other flavors that i really like like the tropical punch the pomegranate the watermelon like they have such good flavors but i just wanted to have one of those and have one of these so i got that and lastly i got coconut oil spray because i'm running out of my coconut oil that I have from Costco and I'm moving soon and I didn't want to buy another big one until I moved. So that is everything that I got at Trader Joe's. That is my grocery haul for today. But yeah, thought I would explain that a little bit as to how much I spent and everything that I got. Hopefully that is helpful for you and to show you some of the snacks that I've been really liking, especially the lentil wraps. Those are my fave. Like it's fully vegan, it's really good. So if you're able to try that, I would say give it a shot. I I don't think you'll regret it. I always warm mines up in the air fryer. If I had a microwave, I would do that too. But air fryer is just as good. So I use my Instapot air fryer and warm it up. I like to have it warm. I've never really had it cold. I don't think I would want it cold, but it says on the packaging that you can have it either cold or hot. So. It's up to you, but I'm gonna have that with now for like my lunch, dinner, I don't know, situation, because it's food today has been all over the place, but I'll have it when I'm hungry in a few hours. Um, but yeah, 
If you made it to the end of this video, thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you like any part of this video. Subscribe so you can keep up to date with me and all the things that I am doing. And comment down below, say hi, I say hi back. And don't forget to stay kind, stay true, and stay laughing. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.